Downtown Orlando was practically shut down today. Thousands of people from across Central Florida showed up to show their pride or support at Lake Eola today. Last night, we told you about the event's economic impact as the largest parade and festival in the area. And today, we saw how big it was. News 6 is Carolina Cardona is live in downtown Orlando, where people are sticking around for the big fireworks show now. Carolina? Yeah, that's right, Eric. What an eventful day it has been right now. Behind me, people have gathered here at Lake Eola, and they're being entertained by a few speakers and entertainers, performers who are singing and just dancing. And everyone is really embracing today and having a really good time. Earlier today, we got to see the parade of floats that kicked off this mega celebration. With colorful flags, outfits, music, and pride, downtown Orlando celebrated the 16th annual Come Out With Pride event. The LGBTQ plus movement started because of black and brown trans women decided to give birth to a revolution, and that is what started Pride. The event is put together by an all-volunteer group of the Come Out With Pride nonprofit organization which has been supporting the LGBTQ plus community since 2005. As you can see, today is an incredible day for our community, but this is an opportunity for us to come out in person, celebrate who we are. People from different countries, backgrounds, and ethnicities came together and cheered along more than 100 floats from various organizations and companies along Orange Avenue. Yes, baby. A celebration that brought tears to some like Crispy Nato from Puerto Rico. I'm super happy because I have my mom here. I am uh, my fiance. I'm so happy. Yo estoy super emocionada. Chris's mother tells us she's very excited because Chris is everything to her and she's happy to be here in support of her and everyone in the community. We are all the same. We all deserve the same love and support, she said. Honestly, today means a lot. Um, I came out at a very young age and I was blessed to have a family that loves and supports me and this just is a celebration of LGBT community, all the allies. According to event organizers, more than 185,000 people joined the festivity, making the event the area's largest single day parade and festival. Today means a lot to me just knowing that it was a hard time having my parents accept me, but just coming out here just feels like home. And so now this event is supposed to end around 11 o'clock and just about in a couple of hours that big fireworks show is going to take place. So of course a lot of happiness here today, a lot of love, support and pride. Eric, back to you in the studio. Carolina Cardona live for us tonight. Thank you.